Good evening. Welcome to tonight's concert, Napa Valley Middle School 8th grade band and Napa Valley High School concert band. We're excited to perform for you. If you would please make sure your cell phones are set to stun, or at least so they won't make an audible sound, that would be great. And we will start with our first piece, band player, band pair, and flourishes. was a great piece for this group. It was our real first serious foray into cut time, which is kind of tricky. It's a different way of counting the quarter notes and eighth notes that they've been playing since fifth grade, some of them longer than that. Um, it was also a, a good journey into marcato style. Um, so it was a challenging piece, but it was really fun working on it. Is Mr. Bakken still here? Okay. Um, the picture that was taken, I neglected to say this earlier, um, you'll be able to buy um, 8 by 12 copies of the picture and your kids will be taking that home. You'll get that in band rehearsal. Moving on to our next piece, As Tears Fall on Dawn's New Light, this piece is about um, some sorrow and some happiness. It's about persevering. It was commissioned by Phil Campbell High School from Alabama, and it was in honor or in memory of a tornado that struck their community and devastated their high school and their band room in 2011. Um, this piece is challenging because it takes a lot of energy to sustain slow music, but we've really enjoyed working on it. Thank you.
Before I talk about our last piece, I would like to say a thank you to the kids behind me for their hard work so far this year. They are rehearsing so well. Mr. Dason and Mr. Scalise, you are going to love the way these kids work for you next year. Parents, encourage your kids to stay in band for high school so that they can experience what the ninth graders are experiencing. They sound really good. They'll sound just as good next year, too because of hard work and, and great teaching. Our final piece is Flight of Eagles, and while it'd be nice to make up a story about how it's all about the Apple Valley <coughs> Eagles, it's really just about the bird, the eagle. Um, this is a fun piece. It has lots of energy. I hope you enjoy it.
I really enjoy rehearsing with this group. I especially enjoy rehearsing this next piece. Uh, it's called the Haunted Carnival. And we start working on it, you know, a little bit before Halloween. And it just it feels to fit the mood. It also reminds me of a story that I probably should tell my therapist, not you all, but uh, when I was in fourth grade, I went off to church camp in the fall, and we went on a haunted walk. I have very few memories of this camp other than the end of the haunted walk where I got chased the whole group got chased by a, uh, some masked man with a chainsaw. And I was thinking about this the other day, like, this was in fourth grade. Like, how am I not traumatized by this? In any case, they sound much better than my scarred memory. Here is a haunted carnival. Thank you. 
Good evening. One of the things that you're going to notice about the ninth grade program is that we're playing music of all different styles. We started with an overture, we went to a contemporary piece. Now the next piece we're going to play challenges the students in a different way. The next piece we're going to play is a slower, more melodic, more connected tune. And it challenges the students to listen, work on their intonation, work on their musicality, uh, those types of things uh, as well. Thank you for coming to the concert tonight. We're going to end our concert with Avengers Endgame after we play an endless song. <laughs>